Hi, uh, I'm gonna build a transformer using these cores, uh, these pieces of iron I collected from work. They are magnetic. Here's the magnet, and here's the wire for secondary, and this is wire for primary coil. I'm gonna put this piece of paper to insulate the cores. Okay, like this goes around. Insulate them from each other. I install this from work. Now I'm gonna wrap my primary in this iron core. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine. Make sure they're compact. Should I do more? Mm, I do 24 turns. Okay, I'm gonna wrap paper around it for the next layer. Here's my paper, I'm gonna cut from here. Uh, this goes on. Okay, one uh, sixteen. I don't know. Here's the primary, it is finished. Now I'm gonna put another layer of paper on top so I can start the secondary winding.
I better make some more of this paper insulator. Here's the wire I have. I'm gonna open it. Hmm. I'm gonna do 200, 440 turns. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, five, eight, 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 five,
to find the pins of the transistor you search the name this is base collector and emitter from internet images emitter goes to negative base comes from signal collector goes to transformer Okay, here's the high voltage output. I'm gonna add capacitors to lower frequency. It gets dimmer with the lower frequency. So probably need to go higher. Now I'm gonna turn it into DC using a diode and capacitor. Okay, now connect the power. The transistor. What? I said blue. Now I'm gonna measure the voltage. DC. This is 5 volt in. This is the voltage input 4.4 because it is under load. The 5 volt is dropping to 4. Now here. 84 also because of this load voltage is limited if I remove it it will go higher that's the output voltage Wow, blue arc. This is charged now. Oh shit. This can shock very badly.
Oh god, what if it's too high? I'm trying to charge my headphones, see if it, this is a 220 volt inverter, phone charger, 25 volts, this transformer is designed for 12 volts, but I'm gonna, this is weak, but I try it, anyway, here's a neutral and face, I'm gonna put, Well, it turns on and off. The current is not enough. I'm gonna switch this for a 12 volt higher current. This is 0 0.5 amp, half an amp at 5. Now I'm gonna use this power supply 12 volt, 5 amp. I better solder the wires to it so I don't strike myself. This one is a bit more dangerous, it has a lot of power, 10 times more current and twice the voltage. Now I'm gonna plug it in. Okay. Shit. That is so bright. This is a good transformer we made. Now let's see if it charges my headphone. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't burn my headphone. It is charging. It has so much power. Can it charge my phone? Let's see the voltage while it is powering this and that. 5 volts this limits the voltage if we do not put any load on it it will arc the arc will jump inside this and damage the coil so must have load on it always. How about this now? Yeah, it works. Hmm. Now the video is finished. I can damage the transformer, so I will have it open circuit like this to arc. Look at this high voltage.
Now let's see with the capacitor. It might explode because the voltage is too high. So I'm gonna wear my my safety glass. I'm gonna put this 3 kV high voltage capacitor to see how high the voltage can go on this. There's the meter. Oh shit. It overloaded. 3, 2, 1. Three, two, one. Okay. Can it create artwork on cardboard? Now, now without the DC section. AC from transformer. That 4 kilohertz is sounds so nice. This is so loud. The transformer, the I wire transformer, five five timer. This is warm. NPN transistor. This is the power supply. It's so tiny. 